Hi, I'm Annie Botticelli, and this is the Storyteller Forecast for December for Leo. So if Leo is your rising sign, or if Leo is your sun sign, then this is for you. Um, many Leo um, rising sign and Leo sun sign will be having something new going on in their home. So that could be um, you're moving to a new home. It could be that you have a new entrance into your home, either in the form of a child, which could be a surprise, which we'll talk more about, or it could be expected. Um, or you can have a relative or someone else move in, um, a roommate, um, but something new about the house. You could be closing on a new home. The lunar eclipse is occurring from, for all sun sign Leos and most rising sign Leos from about 13 degrees on. Um, it's happening in the 10th house of career and work. So many of you will also be losing your job, um, either voluntarily or um, as a surprise. So just know that this is part of the cosmic plan. If that has happened and you're, you're startled or jostled by it, it's possible that the move has to do with losing a job or the move has to do with a transfer with your job. Um, and, but there's a lot of energy around work, home, different work, different home energy. You also have Venus going through your fourth house. Mercury has been retrograde in November, will continue through November, and then into December will be clear. But there's a tremendous amount of energy of you rethinking, reconsidering your home space. And so it's possible that that's why you move. If you are watching this in November and you have to make a decision, then try to wait until December if you can, because you don't have all the information yet. And Mercury retrograde is never a really good time to make um, an important decision about something, especially around eclipse time, because you don't have all of the information from the eclipses delivered yet, and it will be relevant. So, if you were not trying to have a child, many of you are going to be surprised that you're pregnant. And um, there's a lot of activity in your creative sector. For some of you, it could just be um, a focus on creative projects that have nothing to do with children, or they could be focused on children that are not your own. But lots of energy in that Leo fifth house sector. You've got Mars going through your sixth house. It has been in November. It's going to continue in December. And that makes it a really great time to start to do a daily meditation. So I think that everyone will be served by doing a daily meditation. I think the world would be served by everyone doing a daily meditation. So it would be really great for the Leo energies to um, try to start that now if you don't already have that going on. Because you have a really solid amount of energy supporting making a daily habit of something that may have been difficult before. Um, if you, it's possible that you have had enough of your job and that you, that's why you're deciding to leave. If that's the case, you may be starting a home business. Um, and the universe is really energetically supportive of that right now. You leaving a jobby job, working for somebody else, and you working for yourself at home or some sort of home-based work for somebody else um, is really supported. So if you've lost your job and you weren't trying to, then that's okay too. Um, consider doing something from home or um, starting your own business, which again, in, this, in any case, wait to launch anything until December. If you have to get a domain name or form an LLC or um, start a website, then you can be working on those things now, but don't do anything official. Don't do any paperwork that's official until December. And I like the second week in December for for everything pretty much around December 13th, um, the new moon. New moons after Mercury retrograde are very powerful for launching projects that you've been considering during the retrograde period and before. I can't see everything in your chart. Um, I always highly recommend a personal reading with me because what we can see in a natal chart, in a transit chart, with your birth information is astounding. I've been doing this professionally for um, over 10 years even though the uh, horoscopes and the videos are new to me, um, astrology is not new to me. And I'm astounded all the time by what we can see and the accuracy of what we can see. We can look at business timing. We can look at decision timing for things not in business. We can look at love things, relationship things. We can do synastries with you and your partner, with you and a prospective partner, um, with you and your kids. So if you're interested in a reading, you can contact me through the information below this video. You can go to my website. You can also read more about what clients have to say about sessions with me. 
And um, if you sign up for my Storyteller newsletter, then you'll get great information every month and a $15 off coupon for personal reading. So I hope that you have a great December and um, happy holidays.